Hey, my widow creeps. Oh, oh. All right, so I know y'all probably like, why is she on this camera with this dry ass face? All right, that is because today's video is about Le Abrao. Say it with me, Le Abrao. Okay, Le Abrao will be your eyebrows. Y'all know what that is. Anyway, today, I have like a little mini tutorial that will be at the end of the video in reference to my eyebrows and the products that I have been trying lately or whatever to this I've been using on my eyebrows. Y'all know I'll be having some little moments. I just had one. But anyway, let's go ahead and get it started. Um, so the video is not too long. Yada yada yada. Alright, so the newest thing that I am trying this is NYX eyebrow marker. And I have it in the, which is the darkest um, color. And this is what it looks like. I don't know what the camera focusing for y'all. But it's in color deep. And this is what it looks like. It's a very precise pin. And um, I got it from eBay. I'm really not sure if NYX still has these on their site or not. I believe they do. But I got mine from eBay. Um, and it was about $8 and it had free shipping and everything. So this is something that I've been using on my eyebrows for basically the ending of my eyebrows for a more precise line and not too close to the front because this deep does come off, you know, really dark. I have dark eyebrows, but I still like the fading effect. I don't like it to be dark all the way through. So I use this probably from about this point over and then I do light strokes here. Then I the follow up with NYX eyebrow pencils. Now I love these because they are really um precise and they don't come off really easily like when you're doing it so it gives it makes it easier for you to do the light strokes and to get the fading effect because as soon as you're hitting your eye it's not just coming off and it starts off light and you can build this up so this is a good thing it comes with a little brush so you can do your um you know comb your eyebrows down first and i use this little brush to give my fading effect i go instead of this way i go backwards and then i go pretty much up and then just kind of and you know how to blend it whatever is your preference you don't have to do it like i do it you know find out what works for you and your eyebrows mine are already pretty thick i kind of wax them down pretty thin not what i normally do but um to get them back you know thick i just draw them in until they get back on them i use the deeper one first from here to meet with the marker. Then I go in with the light, which is a medium brown, and this one is dark brown. But medium brown I use here to give my lighter fading. It just makes it easier for me instead of continuing to try and, you know, brush it and fade it lighter and you take too much off and you gotta put something back on. Yeah. So next, we'll discuss this palette, which I'm pretty sure you can get it from any other, um beauty website like BH Cosmetics, so forth. But I got this from eBay, it came from China. It took about a week and uh, this is what I've been using for years. It um, has 15 colors, let me show you again. It has the corrector in it. It has different colors from light to dark or whatever. And what I do when I use it, I use the lighter color, which is here under for the highlight sometimes i mix the two depending on what makeup i'm doing or if i'm going today like bare face i want it to look as natural as possible so you know i'll do the lighter color um not so much just to clean it up and then i'll go on top with the color either one shade lighter than me or the same color as me on top to prevent that halo effect you know sometimes when you do the lighter color at the top if you don't blend it all the way then you'll have that halo that's what i call it where it looks like you have like something over your eye it's not like a natural highlight it just looks like you got something else so i'll do a couple closer to my skin tone for that um the last thing I have is the model in a bottle. I'll talk about I, these pencils. I know y'all see me use two different, um, excuse me, not pencils, brushes. See me use two different ones on my eyebrows. This is a more precise slim, and this is the wider, like, you know, similar to an angle brush 
or whatever the flat top liner brush both come from BS Cosmetics they were about two bucks um, each and I used this one today in the tutorial what this one helped this one is really precise if you think you're gonna be you know pretty sure you don't want to bring any concealer down into your eye you can just use this this one it'll help with the blending upward you know and downward on your eye you guys get what I'm saying I also use that concealer palette on my little mustache yes I get a little mustache I have to take it down I'm a hairy person take it down and then I put a little concealer whatever we ain't talking about that right now we'll talk about that time. next is the model in the bottom okay that is what it looks like now it comes in a clear packaging and it um also has a brush that looks like a nail polish brush it has this spoolie that comes inside it already and then the nail polish brush um I lost my nail polish brush which I'm upset about I can't find it um so what I did in the video you see me use the precision brush from BH cosmetics for my fading reason I do that is I use this I like this better than the brush because sometimes the brush can put too much um but I take this go through my eyebrows you know put it on top and it seals them basically it seals the the eyebrow pencil on so you don't have to worry about sweating it off or you rubbing it off like I tested this out I went to sleep woke up the next day my eyebrows were still there all the way through the end of the day so I was just like oh god I gotta wash my face like you probably can have the eyebrows can probably last you two to three days if you know you do it correctly try not to use too much of it because you do not want that shiny finish you use just enough it, it'll hold him on like you see me rub my eyebrows they're not going anywhere that is what this does I like to use the nail polish part here just so that I don't brush out my fading you know the nail polish just allows you to polish it here and then you can use the rest you know to make sure that your eyebrows are laying down like they're supposed to but um as for this I got this from eBay also it's available on eBay Amazon and modelinabottle.com um I paid about I believe mine was nine dollars um I've seen it as expensive as 15 but I got mine for nine dollars so you can search model in a bottle on eBay or you can go directly to the website to find this now what I'm gonna do now is just a swatch of the eyebrow marker on my hand so you can see you know what it does before you do anything on top of these eyebrow markers or pencils make sure that everything is dry or you will wipe it off so all right that's the marker all right so we're gonna let it dry and these pencils come in lighter colors too they come in taupe and nude and all kinds of colors okay this is the deep see how i gotta kind of like keep rubbing which is what i like because you can build it up and this is the medium brown right here it's just a little lighter now the eyebrow pencil oh, excuse me marker you can also build it up all right it should be dry now all right so bam nothing didn't come off so see the good thing about this is you use it with the model in the bottle.com and you have like model in the bottle.com model in the bottle and you have like a double ceiling bam it don't get no better than that my english is horrible um anyway y'all if you have any other questions about this or where to get it from i will have all the links down below um yeah that's pretty much it i'm gonna include the mini tutorial at the end and pictures of all these items together so that you can see what they look like to make sure you're getting the right thing and i love you guys and i will talk to you later please stay tuned for my collab video with pink sugar spice that will be up shortly when i say shortly i don't mean like today i be mean like so come so stay tuned i love you guys ooh, ooh. make sure i get them brows right I'm watching you. I'm, I'm the brow police. I am watching for bad eyebrows. And I'm giving out tickets. I love you. <laughs> Bye. Bitch, I'm from the south, south. Where the old school swing in the trunk so bang. Bitch, I'm from the south.
niggas that know what I'm about. The chicks in the hood with the grills in they mind. The independent women, the hard working pimps, the bro that gave her all in the club where she stripped. The niggas that will, the boy locked down. The educated brothers, my folk underground. The whole third coast, I do it for the world. Every man, woman, boy, and little girl that know about the South. Where the old school swing and the trunks on bang. The south, south, where the girls come feed, get money, ain't shit. It, it, it's, I'm from the south, south, where the doughs fold up, grip, grain, get bugged. It, it, it's, I'm from the south, south, chop, 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 no blades, and jam and screw tape.